Hey you guys, this is your admin, Victor Casino. I'm here with another strategy on Sportybed. I'm not going to waste much of your time here, but I really want to say this video is for educational purposes only. So whatever we use here is just a means for better understanding. All right. So if you're new to my channel, kindly subscribe, like the video. If you're not done, then turn on the bell icon and do it to comment anything you want me to work on this platform or, or any platform at all. That money has to be made. I'll do well to present a video to you guys. So that being said, let's get down to business. So when you come to your Sportybed account, just, um, um, I believe the interface is like this. Now click on the instant virtual uh, option, click on it. I know some of you will be like, I've not been posting video for some time, guys. I told you to do where well to join us on Telegram by checking the link on the description. You join us there. A lot of things have been stopping there because I have some restriction of not posting videos. Well, but finally, I scale out those restrictions. You know, I expose a lot of loophole here. So I'm open for stuff like that. So guys, like I said, I don't want to waste your time. So the strategy I'm about teaching you guys is just a simple strategy and over 1.5 strategy. All right, and over 1.5 strategy, and you can as well play it as over 2.5, but it's more accurate on over 1.5. But I do play it on over 2.5 because of the odd range. Using a staking plan, I'm more profitable on the system. So without saying much, let's get down to it. So the very first thing you need to do is when you come to a statistic here on Instant Virtual, you're playing the highest away to be over 1.5. Now, let me explain what I mean by that. You scan through all the away option here. Okay, all the away option from England to Germany, you pick the most highest, all right, and play that game over 1.5. If you want to stick to over 1.5, good. I mean, I stick to over 2.5 because of the odd range. But for the sake of this video, I'm telling you guys that over 1.5 is very, very accurate. All right, so let's go. Um, so I'll go to, I'm seeing this uh, 6.58 as the highest odd, right? So 6.58, the highest so far. So let's check if there's any 6 point anything. Okay, we are still checking our way. We have seen 9 point. So 9.38 is the highest so far. So I'll be playing this 9.38 as over 1.5. Now you can see that the over 1.5 is not encouraging, right? The over 1.5 is not encouraging. Yeah, it's not encouraging. So game like this, I can play this away to win. Like, if I want to take high risks on it, I can play this guy over 3.5, over 2.5, and over 4.5. Like, I wait to score over 3, over 4, over 5. This option here. Please, you don't have to do this, okay? You don't have to do this. This one is not part of our, our teaching today. What I'm just saying is you stick to your over 1.5 or over 2.5. So, but I'm playing the impossible odds. That's what I'm playing. I'm playing under. Under, you know, under 0 0.5. This kind of game is going to play under. You will play more than over 1 either. You understand? So, playing under 1 is not the choice option. So, I'm going to remove that. So, this kind of game, if you want to play this kind of game, what you simply do is go to the nearest odd, which is above 1.65 now or 1.60 the reason why i say you need to go to the highest odd or the nearest order has 1.60 is because if you lose because definitely you're going to lose but the winning is very accurate on it all right if you lose applying a staking plan on it will make you stay profitable on it okay now what i'm trying to say is let's say um um let's say this is the nearest over 1.60 if i lose on this game now i'll look for the next nearest over 1.60 why because I'll just take my staking. Let's say I'm starting with, let's say, for example, 100 naira, right? 100 naira now multiplied by 3 will give me 300. If I stick 300 on this game now, I'm going to recover the 100 naira I stick before and I'll recover the 300 I used and make an additional profit. So that's how staking plan actually works. All right? That's how it actually works. But on your very first stick, you can go ahead to play over 2.5 because you have not lose any game. Okay? The odds is small. You have not lost any game. It's only when you lost your first game. That's when you now look for next odd, the nearest odd. Any game you lose, you now the next one you want to play, look for the nearest odd that is bigger than 1.60, like from 1.60 and above, so that when you apply the recovery plan, depending on the amount you're using, you will now recover if the game actually won. You understand? So I'll give you guys some progression of 100, 109 on how you can scale to it. All right? So let's get down to it. So I'll be playing this game. Um, Let's say the nearest. So I'll play this game. Okay, it's my first game. So I can play over 2.5, but let me just play over 3.5. So I'm going to kick, when you come now to your kickoff, you're going to single this game. The reason I'm singling this game is because I play other two options. All right. I play a way to score over 2.5 or 3.5. You understand? 
this i play a way to score over 2.5 and over 3.5 so they have 60 and 13 out here so i'm going to single this game but on your own scenario you're not single the game because you'll be playing a single game right it's just a single game with one option so for this video i'll be single this game um i know this is impossible but i'll be single it um um 300 so if our first option shows up which is over 3.5 i wait to score four goals we'll be going home with this amount if i wait to score um is it two goals yeah a three goals we're going home with this amount but it looks so impossible right but our normal game play here is over 3.5 right meaning any of the team can score four goals all right so let's kick off so don't get it twisted guys just pay attention so you don't make errors on our on our calculation so we have scored one goal all right so home have scored one goal so of our 1.5 has play already so we're expecting it to play on uh, over 2.5 all right, so any side can play our over 2.5, so our over 2.5 ticket to win. So you can see we are scaling on 2 1 now, that's 3 1. All right, so the game ends at 3 1. So it means our ticket of over 1.5 has played, right? But our ticket of the one, the two option I play, impossible odd, did not play yet because normally it's impossible odd. So, guys, you now see the difference. So, same thing applies. I don't want this video to be long. Same thing applies on all the options. So, let me just quickly go to our one, next one. Now, just let's just go to you. Let's go to you guys. Please do it to subscribe, guys. If you have not, comment, turn on the bell icon so if I drop a video, because I'll be dropping video these days mostly every day because so to keep my page very active due to the restriction i had before guys so do it to support the page i love you guys so much you're really 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 doing best for me so let's go let's go guys um the next highest away so i'm seeing 5.16 so far as the highest 5.16 so we're scrolling down 5.16 5.16 5.16 5.16 5 so i'm seeing 9.37 i think they'll be the highest 9.37 so 9.37, yeah, that's the highest as I see. So I'm going to play this guy now. Remember, we win our first hand. So I'll just go ahead and play it on uh, the next hand uh, over 3.5. But there's no point. I really love going to any odd that is 1.60 and above. Remember, you play any odd on your first hand. It's only when you lose before you start chasing 1.6 odd due to the progression I'm going to show you guys on your staking plan. So let's take this one, then I'll take you guys to the progression. I don't want this video to be long, guys. I'm trying my best to be um to be fast so um i'll go to the nearest four point then i'm playing my impossible odd yeah which is a way to score over three goals and over 2.5 goals it's impossible odd guys very very impossible so i'm going ahead and single this game 300 very very impossible odd but pay attention to our over 2.5 or that's what i want you to pay attention to so let's kick off Pay attention to the two goals we are expecting them to score. So we have one goal so far, which is home. All right, we have one goal so far, which is home. Good, home has score one. Remember, pay attention to uh, over, is it over 1.5 and over 2.5? But I didn't play over 2.5. I play over, I play over 4.5. They are expecting them to play more than four goals, though. But you have checked our over 1.5 has played, but our over 2.5 did not play. So let's see. This is your first game you lose on over 2.5. This is where our calculation and our progression now comes in. So I'll take you guys to a page whereby we'll be doing the calculation there. All right. So this is our kind of progression you'll be using. You might have your own staking plan, but this is the staking plan I use. So let's say um we want to use a very simple staking plan of 100 naira. So your staking will be 100 naira. Okay, next stick will be um 300, right? Next stick will be 900. So the next will be one eight, yeah. So this is four sticking plan. That's four sticking plan, right? So you're taking a progression of times three. So let me just show you guys it's times three progression. So if I lose up to this amount, then I'm gonna I'm gonna if I lose up to this amount here. I'm going to multiply this amount by three, right? So this is the progression I'm using, okay? And the odd range, the odd range, let me also type the odd range so you know what you're looking for, the odd range. Um, we need an odd from 1.60 and above when you lose, okay? When you lose, guys, so that is it. So that's the progression we use, guys. So now we have lost, let's say I play over um 2.5 and I lose 100. So my next stake 
will be 300 so that's how you do the progression calculation just take one more and i'll be sticking 300 on that right so let's count through the highest the highest the highest again so i'm seeing 504 as the highest so far 504 i'm seeing 567 as the highest 567 as the away highest 567 i think that's the highest so far okay 567 so i'll go to it this is it this is it guys good real madrid so i'll be playing real madrid over 2.5 remember that our odd range we we're looking from is from 1.67 and above right 1.60 and above so we have more than 1.60 here. so i'll go ahead and play 300 to kick off now this is what i'll advise you guys now this is where the advice aspect comes in now pay attention to this you can as well skip this game you can skip this game to a point it favors you so when you start seeing all those smaller odds, i will advise you not to pay attention to it just go ahead and click on your skip button simple just click on skip button make sure you have that like now you can see just two odd i have that two odd on over 2.5 both of them to score over 2.5 I seen it. So we actually get the over 2.5 odd. Over 2.5. So I definitely win and I recover everything I lose, right? Simple as that. So I, I stick on, uh, let's say I stick, the first one was, let's do growth calculation. The first one was 100 now, right? The second one was 300, which is total of this is 400, right? So I stick 300 and win 600, right? So I don't want you to know that it's profit. So if you minus the 400 from this 600, I'm ending with 200. So I make 200 hour profit. So imagine you're using 1,000, you make 2,000 hour profit. So that is how the calculation is. It's very simple. The moment you start to play with sticking progression, the moment you start to stay profitable on the system, that is it. Very simple. Pay attention to that. Don't just come and start playing 500, 1,000. No. Take it as an investment. Don't take it like normal betting. You are investing on the system. You need to have a stop range, take profit, and where you cannot go beyond and when you cannot accept loses you understand so guys good luck um i wish you guys good luck um do it if you love my content do it to subscribe guys and i encourage everyone join us on telegram be a part of the family i love you guys signing out now waiting for my next video